Good evening and thanks for watching tonight. Just a few days ago, they were celebrating his birth, and now a family is hoping for the best after a newborn is seriously injured by the family pet. Investigators say the attack happened today at a home along Beaumont Road that's not far from Nicholasville. Police say a dog grabbed a three-day-old boy at the neck and then dragged him several yards. Now we have some new video into News First. The dog is said to be an American Indian mix. It is now under quarantine while the investigation is carried out. Again, this is some new video of the dog into our newsroom. That animal is being held at the Jessamine County Animal Shelter. Our Janet Kim, meantime, Janet Kim rather, is uh, live at UK Hospital in the meantime, where that child is being treated. It is our top story at six. Janet. Well, we've been told this newborn is here at UK Hospital recovering after authorities say they found him with serious injuries after he had been dragged 150 yards from the family's home. A newborn baby is rushed to UK Hospital. I heard all the sirens. Um, I was trying to catch my horses and they were running and I went up to the road and saw animal control and the fire trucks and several sheriff's cars. But they all soon learned the neighbor's pet dog was caught dragging their baby into the woods. It was my understanding that both parents were downstairs and the child was upstairs in a crib. Uh, and the, uh, right now what we're getting is that the animal actually uh, made its way into the house uh, unknown to the parents uh, and uh, grabbed the child out of its crib. Neighbors say the incident comes as a shock for this quiet community. You know, I'm just devastated. Um, anything like this that happens around here is just really heartbreaking. Neighbors have identified the parents as Michael and Chrissy Smith and say the dogs were actually bought specifically for their children. Um, we've known them for a while. We've been up there. Um, we've met the dogs. Um, I know, I believe that they got the dogs special because they were hypoallergenic. Now investigators are trying to determine what went terribly wrong. The animal's kind of part of the family. You know, I, you know it's a process. I, I, bringing the child into the home, introducing the animals. Don't know how comfortable the animals were around the children. Uh, so it's just one of those things that you know, we may never know. I mean, it is an animal. Now we've been told that the family has other children who also live in the home, but they say they were not home when this incident happened. Reporting live in Lexington at UK Hospital, Janet Kim, WKYT 27 News First. Investigators say it's still unclear if any criminal charges will be filed.